Kelly O'Hara becomes the 36th women's player in U.S. history to play 100 times for her country. When I was a kid, I, I mean, I, I just played so many sports that I never thought soccer would be the one. I remember being called into my first youth team camp in LA, and as soon as I got there and put on the practice gear with the crest, I, I was hooked, and I didn't ever want to not get called back in. It's a special night for Kelly Harrell. Let's make sure she leaves this field a winner. Okay, let's get it done. Oh, yeah. Yeah. This team is like a family to me, and some of these people I've been around since I was 15. Tobin's one of them, and a lot of these girls are like sisters to me, so it was really special, and just to be able to thank the team for being great teammates and, you know, supporting me and getting me this far was nice to be able to do. It was an amazing atmosphere to play in Denver. They always have a great crowd, so that was awesome, and just being able to have my parents and my brother and sister and sister-in-law on the field was awesome because they've been such a big part of this journey for me and I wouldn't be here without them. And just seeing their faces and being able to give them hugs and say thank you was pretty cool. I think I just always thought about winning World Cups and Olympics and that sort of thing. Never really thought about, you know, playing X amount of games with the women's national team. Hitting the 100 cap milestone is just a really exciting moment because of how many amazing women who have gone before me have done that. So just to be a part of the 100 Cap Club and know who's part of that as well is pretty cool.